So this is my uh, early morning start. I always take my Twizy to the airport and it was particularly wet. But it's about 20 minutes. Leave Twizy in the uh, car park. Takes up a huge amount of space as you can see. It's then uh, fly with Logan Air from Kirkwall and my flight was down south to Edinburgh and it was a bit of a bumpy landing. It was about an hour and 15 minutes to pick up this beautiful black Ascenta leaf that I bought to order for a customer. So then it's a quack back across the new Queensbury Bridge heading for Kinross Park and Ride, one of my regular stops and uh, the leasing company had charged it up so this was my first stop. It wasn't too far, I think it was about 45-50 miles from where I started my trip. So this is one of uh, two rapid chargers that will charge this 24 kilowatt hour leaf up in around about 25 to 30 minutes. It's a question of offering up the card and then after 25 minutes off we go. So my next stop was Aberdeen. Oh, no, it wasn't actually. I was heading for Aberdeen but then uh, wanted to check out the new Dundee rapid charging hub. This is absolutely fantastic. Well impressed. So it's a slight detour off my normal route by about two miles to check out uh, L's rapid charging hub for those on social media. L of She's Electric on Twitter. This is her personal hub. It's not really, but everyone likes to think that it is. Um, nice Evolt machines. And, uh, yeah, I was well impressed. So easy to use screens. First time I've used one of these new designed Evolt Rapids. Nice and straightforward, which is what we like to see. Simple graphics to tap on the screen. And then plugging in my DC Rapid, rapid Charge connector, the Chadamo connector. go back to activate or start the charge and then uh, it starts charging happily away you'll see some blue flashing lights in a minute just reflected on the dashboard there we go just where my coat is so the first one solid means it's over 33 percent so now a little wander around so we've got so solar panels on the canopy which is brilliant and just behind that fence is some battery storage. The other side of the uh, charging hub, we've got three twin fast chargers, so six cars can fast charge. And then we've got six triple headed DC rapids. Now I'm talking now because there's a lot of wind noise. So I'm just talking over the video that I shot. You can see why they cited it here because just down there is quite a huge electrical substation. So for each of these 50 kilowatt charges you obviously need quite a bit of oomph power electricity. But very nicely done. Um, a little picnic area to the left. See the solar panels there on top of that canopy. And there was even some small LED lights in the, in the roof underneath the canopy. There's another shot of the solar panels. It makes so much sense. Cover the canopy and panels, battery storage. So um, you've then got rapids using power off the batteries before they pull off the grid. I was then heading for Aberdeen. Loads of time. Beautiful run up the uh, east coast of the A9. And this is my other normal stop. If I've got plenty of time, the ferry is only two miles away. I pull into the Snow Sport Centre, which is next to the Asda in Aberdeen. And this is a quite an old rapid. And it's literally a mile and a half, two miles to join the queue to get on the Northland boat back to Orkney, which is where this Nissan Leaf Centre was going for my customer. I've speeded this up a little bit because it can get quite boring to watch so the, the men don't really walk that fast and I certainly don't drive this fast onto the uh, onto the ferry. So you can see there's transporters there all ready to go up to Shetland and Orkney of course with uh, goods and 
This takes around five to six hours depending on the sea. We finally arrived, a bit delayed because it was rough, at quarter to 12 p.m. midnight nearly. So then uh, workers come on to take off those trailers. And it's just a matter of queuing to hand over your ticket to prove you've left the boat, you've not gone up to Shetland. And it's a matter of driving out of uh, Hatston, the pier. As you can see, we're nearly approaching midnight. And we left at 5 p.m. So at the top of Hatston here, I'll take a right. And then it's off to towards Finstown. And then I do a right off towards Rendell, which is where I live. So that was my trip. This is what I do for customers buying leaf to order. Great to see the new rapid charging hub too.